An accommodation has been awarded to a Royal Air Force firefighting team whose members responded to last month's fatal bombing of a Warrior armoured vehicle. From Camp Bastion, Rob Olver reports. It has been a particularly sort of demanding tour for Red Watch and you've, uh, uh, you've really stood up to the mark incredibly well. Commendations for Air Force firefighters. Since December, Red Watch's present crew has provided airfield crash cover at Camp Bastion and helped transfer casualties to hospital. An incident response team has also flown to emergencies outside the base. Clearly being able to deal with the sort of traumatic situations that they do uh, takes a, t a particular type of person and being on that high readiness all of the time, you know, through perhaps hours and hours where nothing happens uh, and then immediately being able to spring into life uh, and cope with any sort of emergency that's, uh, that's thrown at them. Arguably, Red Watch's toughest job involved six British soldiers killed last month as an insurgent bomb destroyed their warrior armoured vehicle in a massive blast. We obviously got the phone call through, air horn goes off and then basically everyone together scrambles together to get all the kit ready and we're, uh, we're ready within 10 minutes. So the only information we had when we were on our way out there was a uh, warrior on fire with uh, six POB reported, that's pretty much it. Despite repeated attempts to reach those on board, the scale of the explosion and ferocity of the blaze meant the firefighters were eventually ordered to stop. We cope as a group, to be fair. Um, we know each other that well, that we can all pull together, everyone can talk to each other. Um, no one's ever singled out or anything like that, so the, the morale of the team keeps everyone going through all the, the difficult times that we can face out here. But Red Watch has also saved dozens of lives, and those firefighters in Afghanistan on their first tour of duty say they have no hesitation about returning. It's been an amazing experience, and I've learned a lot about myself. Uh, bonds you close with your workmates and uh, you make friends and it's a great experience at the end of the day. The current members of Red Watch are about to end their tour of duty. After facing so much together and working so closely, they're about to go their separate ways and return to different bases across the UK. Rob Olver, Forces News, Camp Bastion.